So me walking down the road can only be one thing as I pass Shamu. We're going to see Josh and see what he's up to today. And I'm looking at him right now. He doesn't look like he's having a lot of fun. So let's see what's going on. Now I film what I want. Hey Josh, what are you doing today? Oh, we're playing breaks today. How exciting. We're not. Uh, well, Josh is. I'm I'm not. I would not let myself play with your breaks, let alone my own breaks. And let's be honest, you wouldn't let me play with your breaks either. I, I understand that. That's fine. Hey, these are nice wheels. Look at these. They need cleaning, but... Oh. These in a 19 inch, please. So these are the rears that you've already done. You've yeah. already so that, um, taken these apart. Side. So that's Going off that there. side. And, and then uh, that was off the other side. Wow, so <laughs> if you didn't know already, they're not supposed to look like this, are they? They're supposed to be um, so intact, I think the actual word is. That's broken, actually broken. Where's the other bit then? Is it just disappeared somewhere? And that's what they actually should look like. Yeah. So. Yeah. It's all those reverse entries. It's there. all those reverse entries locking up the rear at 130. No, that's rever what that is. reverse entry parking. Oh, reverse entry parking. Yeah. yeah, that's the one. So the discs and pads are already done. We've sort of missed that part. You did that yesterday, I think. Oh, uh, yeah. These are the new ones. Look at this. Drilled and grooved. And they're black. Did you spray them black with... Um... No, they come coated. Look. Oh, they come coated. So you didn't spray your discs. That's a real good idea that you didn't do that. Look at this. Else, look. This is the left. I am putting on the right way. You're putting on the right way. That's all right then. That's really cool that they're black. This is really this cool. Wears off and Obviously, yeah, but I, I, I wish they, well, I wish they stayed black. But it looks really cool. Like the black, the black is really, really cool. So left hand side. Ooh, look at this. Check that out. Here you go, my good sir. Thank you. So although this isn't a how-to, what are you doing? Because we're obviously not going to tell people how they actually do this, but it's a bit tight on there. When it's I a bit tied like a tiger. Just going to grease her up with the cheeky yeah, copper the grease. grease. Yeah, yeah. We grease the actual disc. Yeah. Do not do that. I'm joking. But seriously, you painted that with uh, Helford's paint anyway, so extra stopping power and all that. Poundland paint. Oh, even better. Oh yeah, that is sick. That's going to look great when you um, reverse entry into a parking space. <laughs> Hey Josh, what are you doing? Making wooden brake pads. Oh, you're so cool! <laughs> so these are the new um, brake pads you bought for the front? Yeah. They look like really good, mate. You only need one, don't you? Well, you only need one, yeah. G, -g, 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 -g clamp. Oh, Josh, you're not doing it right. Stop it. Jokes, comment section. Sorry, mate. I'm sure someone has something to say. It's going to be something negative, but don't worry about it. I don't know what's going on, so I'm just here like, yeah. I will say, sorry about the wind noise as well. I haven't actually got a thing on top of this microphone yet, so that'll be why the wind noise is so bad. Back in the shed, and what are we doing in here now? Just cleaning bits up, so you've got to clean bits up because it's got to be clean. And OCD moment. What's that? That's, what's that in the background? What what's in the background? It's blurry, but don't that's... Look don't look at it, don't look at it. <laughs> so I've just put a post on Instagram, this one saying basically if you guys could comment below and we'll talk on topics and discuss things while Josh does uh, the front brakes on the S15. So the first comment is what would be your ideal track setup and what would you do to the S15 differently if you had a fresh platform? Josh, go. I want a K20. K20 Integra, that would be your track Track weapon. thing to do. Track weapon. Yeah. And no, really that much. Yeah. Well, it's, the trouble is, where we are, good. there is no tracks. So realistically, a track car would be has to be trailered everywhere, and the ferry price for a trailer is ridiculous. It's well over a hundred pound before you've even left the island. That's why track cars, you know, just devoted track cars, aren't really the best thing for where we live. I suppose it's a good excuse to buy a road car that you can go and hurt on the road. Favorite S chassis and two reasons why. S15. And why? Yeah. yeah because they look cool. I like S13s because pop-up headlights, but it would have to have some engine swap in it and that would be the second reason why I like the car. V8 turbo or something. <laughs> Only because I, I like that sort of thing, because I'm a bit like that. Would you put the 2J from the Aristo in the 15? Um, I would probably say no to that as well because 
both cars are really nice and you don't want to ruin both to just make one if this did blow up it would go 1j rather than 2j um, no many way. reasons why that is i'd say price for a star because 2j's are out of, yeah, the, out of this world and you've got a manual swap it as well have you been thinking about getting a new car jamie uh not well yeah but like yeah, but no. Yeah, but yeah. no. The Lexus is staying, of course, as a lot of people may know, and I'm doing bits and bobs to it, but I'm always looking at the next stage, let's say, the next sort of, you know, what to get next. It's probably going to be V8 powered, and it's probably going to be something that the internet won't even be interested in, but I will really like, so it's fine. So as you can see, the rotors are back on, the pads are in, the brakes are back together, the spacer is on as well. What spacer do you run on this? 18 millimeters, nice and precise. But the wheel goes back on, and we can start on the other side. So Josh, what? um what happened I don't know what you're talking about. to to this part of the car right here? Why are you lying? Nothing. What there. what happened there then? Low life kicked in and you were like, oh god, low life kicked in! Oh god! I couldn't handle it. Couldn't handle low life, so you had to really, really hurt the car. Oh, well, that, there we go, it's fixed. That makes you a drifter right there. That is so drift right now. Uh, would you and Josh ever buy a shop space with a workshop and go into business together like Artec, who runs a workshop and there's a shop on the side? Were well, you going to employ me as an electrical um, Well, basically, Josh is an electrical engineer and realistically, you only do these things to your cars because you like your car. You would never want to take this take this away from the fun of doing it to your own stuff. Depends on what you're going to pay. Um, what the f... What? <laughs> no. You're, you you are an electrical engineer. You are not a modifier of cars for a living. Do not lie to yourself. You would you would not enjoy this on other people's cars every day, I don't think. There's a fine line between this being a business and enjoying it as a hobby. And that's the that's the bit. Although one day, you never know. FYD HQ um, Tech. <laughs> we could come up with a better name at the time, but that was just off the top of my head. This is really heavy. Here you go. Oh, shit. Here you go, the tube. No, I don't. Stage I didn't stage that at all. Shut up. <laughs> so we need to chat about Jackfest. Yes, we are going to Jackfest on the 30th of April. See, I actually don't know when it is or what it is. Uh, is Silverstone. <laughs> Silverson only because he just said, oh yeah, it's at Stilson. But yeah, we are going. Uh, be videoing the whole day and all that sort of business as usual. We're on the, we're on the SX OC stand. Um, S body lifestyle hashtag. So shows we are doing this year. A lot of people have asked me Instagram, email, to do things, all that sort of stuff. What we're going to do is try and make all of these that we are going to list right now. Uh, so we've got Jetfest, that you've April. 30th of April. JDM Coombe, 10th of June. Players Classic, 17th of June. Definitely doing that. Jap Show, 9th of July. Definitely. Simply Jap Bewley, 30th of July. Jap Performance Show, the indoor one. Oh yeah, indoor one, that was good last year. 20th of August and Tracks. Tracks. So yeah, we're doing all those. If you would like to come and see us um, and our faces on those days, we'll be at those locations. <laughs> well, yeah, our faces might not be there because we'll be really tired, but don't worry about it. <laughs> Uh, what wheels should I get for the Lexus? Um, to be honest, the ones that I want don't exist in this country at this present time for sale. Another question is, a trip to sunny Scotland with a thumbs up. Can we see that? Yes, we can. Yes, I'm going to see Status Era soon, so... <laughs> so as you can see, the next part of the day is Sports Cat going on the S15 because her MOT is due so to make it you know legal and stuff but as Josh is under the car the next thing that's just come through organize a meet or show type of thing at the shop definitely something I want to do but obviously getting the police involved to let them know I'm doing it the council uh, insurance all that sort of good stuff so this is out of the car the decap pipe and the sports cap is in ready for the MOT. The wheels go back on. We're gonna torque the wheels properly, of course, to the right settings. <laughs> 
So we have to show this in every video. What are your talking, talking, talk, talk settings? What Newton meters are we? So 110. If you are gonna take your wheels off, 110 for these, this style of car, this style of wheel. Stud on a Japanese car. Go on to the internet and find out what your torque settings are, because yes. um, they won't be the same as this. Thumbs up.